Hi, this is a commission that I've just finished. It's a personalised version of quiet contemplation of a sandwich. In this video, I'll show you each cam and I'll explain how it works and what it does. Just stop to show you what you're looking at. Uh, here you have a double cam arrangement. You have a small cam that's on a Geneva wheel and this cam follower is floating. It's not anchored anywhere, it's just attached with the control wire to the arm. And this has four positions and in the fourth position, the top position, it pushes this cam follower up in the air. So then the main cam, which hadn't been reaching it, now does reach it and depresses it thus pulling the arm up. What you are looking at, you're looking at it from the back, from this direction, so you can see these two cams, white cams. So here on the left you can see the Geneva wheel turning and on the in the yellow square you can see the two cams. The bottom one is the small one on the Geneva wheel and you see the next time round it will lift and it lifts the cam follower so the cam above can depress it. The eyes and the jaw have a uh, fairly complex concentric uh, build. So uh, you have two cam followers and then you have two cams, one inside the other. So this outer cam, there's a double one and this one sits in the middle. So in the groove, you've got the cam follower that's going through to the eyes. It goes through the tube and for the uh, jaw that sits on the tube which comes down and rests on this cam follower which is a, a double one joined at this end and then this is following this outside one so you can see these little bumps which is where the mouth's opening and closing and you can see this where the eye when it pushes up the eyes look downwards. So here from the front you can see the brass tube which is connected to the jaw and inside the brass tube you can see the brass rod that goes from the eyes down to this bottom cam that's popping up and down there. We'll have a look from the other side and you can see now that there is the two cam followers. One is a double one so that the brass tube can rest on it and the brass rod then goes through it and down to the bottom cam follower and cam. With the head turning there's no gravity to help because the head's just rotating left and right and so the cam follower has a, uh, a steel weight, a blued steel weight on the end to pull it down. And then you've got a cam and when the cam's raised it pushes, rotates this this way thus pulling the lever towards you and if it's lower it goes down and pushes it away and so it moves the head left and right. Notice here the little uh, nylon roller running over the cam, cam from the cam follower just to reduce the friction. The leg swinging is just a uh, elliptical cam and the cam follower again is uh, weighted because you know again there's no gravity uh, involved because the legs are swinging backwards and forwards and so this is just quite a heavy wooden cam follower so it's got enough weight to pull and push and it's going through a couple of t-shaped levers to uh, push the legs backwards and forwards. Here, looking at the other arm, you've got a simple cam arrangement which is depressing a cam follower. It's held in the air by the gravity of the weight of the arm at the other end. And it impacts on the arm through a double lever, so it pulls down on the top part of the arm where there's a free uh, 
lever and that lever then pushes down on this other arm so you get a double action this arm the lower arm goes in the air and then this upper arm turns round so that the sandwich goes to the mouth so thank you for watching i hope you enjoyed the video